Hello YouTube, today I'm gonna show you how you can upscale a SD video up to a HD video. Um, you have several cams um, that create all sorts of uh, formats. I have uh, several cams at least. Um, I have this GVC cam and it creates MOV files, MOV files. And these files, um, yeah here you can see one that I created and I edited the video with uh, my favorite program called Magix and you can see that I have a 643 megabyte file and this is uh, 720 by 576 okay so this is SD format not HD so how to get this thing HD and how to get these numbers down because as you can see 643 megabyte is really big and if you're not so uh, uh, good in uh, if you don't have a fast upload you know this might take hours so how can we um, fix this let's first take a look at the video this is a video that I have to post to YouTube <coughs> it's opening it's also giving the wrong uh, the wrong format in this player let me open it with media player Here we go media player So like, look at this this is the video and this is the original size eh? 720 okay what you're looking 720 at 720 by 576 good quality nice video start page. and this is the original file 600 and something megabyte with Camtasia we can import the file because we created the mp4 file of it when I exported in Magix I created the MP MPEG4 file. So there we go. We just import it, and now you will see that the video is imported. We're gonna import it into Track One in Camtasia, and Camtasia will say, "What do you want to do?" The recording dimension of this thing is 1024 by 576, but that is not true. The recording dimensions. Oh yes, that could be true. No, no, that is not true. The recording dimensions of this thing is 720 by 576, so one number at least it got good there. But we want to make a HD uh, video of this thing, at least HD ready. So we select the new format and we say OK. As you can see that this is the video and this is the format. So what we need to do, we're gonna pull until we see two yellow lines popping up. There you go, then you stop this side we pull it up up to the yellow line now this video will have a HD um, properties you know and because the lens is very good the, the lens of this camera is very good you know the viewer won't um, get the idea that it's being tricked you know this is not some 320 by by 240 video there's not some small video that we made really much bigger as you could see it was just a little bit that we you know pumped it up but this is upscaling and now we will just um, save the file uh, produce and share and we will of course create a HD video mp4 only mp4 only up to 720 so that means you know 720 by 1280 that's the format that we want it to be uh, so this will be the stand alone XBMC layer um, powered by Dell so there we go so this file will be rendered so what I effect did was two renderings I first rendered this file you know that took uh, a little hour at least you know and because I don't want to make uh, I don't want to upload upload this big file I want to create a smaller file with better end properties how could that be possible how can you make something better from something that, yeah well in the computer world it's possible as you could see we did some upscaling and because of the codec of Camtasia the file will also get much smaller than the 600 and I think we will have a file from I think 180 megabytes so 
I think that will be the end result of this video, of this file. I will let you know in the description, so make sure you read the description to see uh, about, you know, the quality of this file. Of course, you will also see this video um, and you will be able to do these things yourself. You can get Camtasia, of course, uh, by going on the internet. And you just go to Camtasia. So you just type Camtasia, and up here you will find Camtasia. Only go to the site of Camtasia, TechSmiths. Don't go to other sites, you know, putting spyware in the. And just get a free trial. And there's also a version for Mac, but I think PowerPC is not. Uh, is not included you should go for the windows version download the trial my at email.com you know and then you download the trial you see click here to start the download it's 244 uh, megabytes but when you have it and you installed it i'm sure that after 30 days you will buy this program thanks again for watching and uh do uh, upscale your uh, good quality videos even though if they don't have the HD uh, format you can upscale with Camtasia and you know still keep a nice decent work uh, from your uh, old works that you uh, record with a good cam with good lenses you know it's all about the lenses you know you can record a video in 640 by 480 but if the lens is good you know you can upscale it as much as well you know there will be an end at a certain moment but for what we have now you know 1280 720 you know no problem of course you cannot pull it you know 640 by 480 is a square so you will have to you know um, use some background in the 1280 by 480 some nice picture that you created in a good quality so you have a back layer and then the video will come the 630 by 480 will come on top but you can still make it bigger of course don't pull it out of its proportions you could make it hd but then you will lose a little piece of the video so i wouldn't do that you could pull, pull it up in the in the corners without you know messing up the, the the structure of the video but then you know it would get like um yeah a square in 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 yeah it would not be you will lose parts in the video you know if it's some uh, road video that you recorded with your 640 by 480 cam you know then you could do that because the the viewer is looking at the middle part of the video but if there's action going on here and action going on there you know that will get out of the of the of the of the video rendering part so you know that part won't be uh, viewable you know it's like cutting out pieces out of the movie to get it you know in the right format of course um, you can uh, if you don't do that you know just pull it as max you know the the 640 will go up to 720 so that's the only you know these two sides you will be able to make 640 720 you know and if you're even in a better uh, video editor that can you know uh, blow it up up to full HD you know then you can pull it up from 640 to 1080 you know but that will be the max and then you will still have a square in the big uh, widescreen uh, that you have uh, up there to make the video in but the sides you can fill up with information text or whatever or some picture you know some background or leave it black whatever you wish to do so that's how to upscale videos uh, by recording in 576 by 720 you will get uh, the best uh, upscaling possibilities to go up to um, uh, high definition at least high HD ready you know it's not full HD it's HD ready but it's good enough so you know the people see, see the, the little HD uh, logo beside your video and you might even get more views just because of that you know but make sure that your quality is good so don't trick the people with the HD logo and then give them a bad quality video because that sucks you know you will lose numbers because of that three hours later it's dark outside the video is long time already on the internet 
and uh, I can uh, not uh, end this video without showing you the result as you can see this is the same video um, that we created in Camtasia no I don't want to replace let me give this uh, rename this is uh, SD oh it's <laughs> it's in use but this file friends the properties of this file the original file was 643 megabyte with a resolution of 720 by 576 and the same file became properties 126 megabytes so not only the file became a HD file but it also became much smaller than the file that I created with Magix. So which one plays more beautiful? Well, let's see. We open this file. And we also okay, open what you're looking at is this the media file. center PC. And if we hold on. So this is the original file. Okay, what you're looking at is a media center PC. And if we go to the start page. And as you can see. The home page, yeah. You will see that um, this one it's all installed. It's showing in a wrong. The start page. It's showing wrong. The home page. But this uh, player likes to do that many times. To me but the system this whole system is gonna be reinstalled today I'm gonna kill the bitch man I'm tired of this stupid computer Windows 8 I don't need Windows 8 anymore 16.9 okay the expect your audio so and now we have them both okay what you're looking at is a media center PC and if we go to the start page this is the original file. Yeah. You will see that um, it's all. And this is the smaller file, but then an HD. The and we're gonna say we go full reboot. screen. You can see it looks good. Just to give you an idea. We did some upscaling happening. here. Maybe I can get some other video here, a little further. You must see this as a media center for your own music. Okay. Here you can see that see? everything is readable. So in fact, if we take a look at the colors, let me go to this part. Okay, what you're looking at is a media center PC. And if we go to the start page, the home page, yeah. You will see that um, it's all installed. We're gonna switch up the system, and we're gonna. It's almost the same, eh? You. Of course, there's been a bit, little bit of compression. The original file will always be, I think, a little bit better. But in fact, hmm. In fact, we still have a winner because the high quality file, I mean, these are, these are like my copyrighted files, you know, these are my products. So the high quality file is still in my, you know, in my possession and um, I uploaded a file with just a little tiny bit, little, how would you say that? Just a tiny. We'll see that, um, well, it's, all, that all it's just is fine. Also Nothing wrong with it, yeah. I just don't know how to get. But I think it's the difference between a WAV file and an MP3 file. Anyway, peeps, this was it. Um, my second video for today already. Uh, local time, 13 minutes past four. So I wish you all a nice day. America is just waking up. Good morning, America. And I say good night, Australia. And my friends in the Netherlands, I say smakelijk eten voor straks. Bye bye.